Hey guys, it's Sonomiko Ryan, and welcome back to another episode of Wind Waker HD. So, we are here, and get in this tower. And we are about to go and, uh, try to infiltrate his, uh, base, I guess. Well, not, what, <laughs> what am I talking about? Oh man, I was trying to do, like, a serious tone, but, like, I, uh, I guess I failed heavily. But, um, today we are going to be going through Ganon's Tower, as I was saying, and we are going to try to get to Ganon today. Uh, again, it's going to be another long recording, so here we go, I guess. Hopefully I can be prepared. Is there, are there any arrows, please? I need arrows, because th that number is bothering me up there. But first, before we actually get to him, we actually have to go through a boss rush. So, we have four options here. So we have the, uh, I guess that's the, the Wind Temple. That is the, I want to say the, uh, the Earth Temple, not the Earth Temple, but, well, that's, that's the, that's the Forest Temple. That's the Earth Temple. And that's, um, I, I can't remember, the Fire Temple, yeah. I think we'll go here first. I might be wrong on, like, the, like, the order that I'm in right now, but, oh, good, good, good job. <laughs> Alright, let's go in, try to get the, through this, this part. Yeah, okay, here we go. So... This part is, uh, is going to be a little bit tricky. Um, I'm going to actually deal with these right here. These guys, because they are not good. I'm guessing the ones that are facing me are the ones that are bad. Okay, can I shoot those guys? Oh yeah, I can. Oh, I didn't notice that the music is different here too. There we go. Okay, this is a little bit awkward. Okay. I guess I switched successfully. Okay, so what I need to do right now is I need to swing over to that, and I, I didn't do that correctly. <laughs> now I have to go and kill all those guys again, right? Yes, I do. Oh well, I, I'm, I'm not going to waste my time with that. And now I have to hurry up and... Oh, hold on, I'm going to get myself back up a little bit. And I'm going to wait for that to go again. Okay. Because I don't want it to suddenly go up on me. Okay. Okay. And now, please don't hurt me. And now... What do I have to do? What I'm gonna do, actually, is I'm going to do that. Okay. Yeah, th I think that was a smart idea. Let's go in and defeat the boss now. Alright, so first off, we have Armagoma, I think is the name of this boss. And uh, now I gotta... Actually, I have like a lot more like limited items now. Like, I, I can't use certain items at this point. Interestingly enough. Okay, whew. I would actually like to get some items, so... I'm gonna get up here real quick. There we go. Just what I needed. Now I gotta wait for his tail to come back down. Okay, this should be easy. Like, really easy. Okay. Yeah, this is actually... Not that bad. It shouldn't be too difficult. Admittedly. Wait, where did all my money go? What the heck? It just all disappeared. I was at a thousand if you saw. Like, what the heck happened? I think that's the last time I need to do it before I need to go and uh, destroy the actual, like, body. Yeah. Okay, that was actually kind of good timing. Okay. There we go. Boom. First boss done. Whew. So there is Armagoma down. Let's go over to the, uh, I think his name is Kaladamos. There we go. Yeah, I think it's called Kaladamos. Like, if I had the, uh, <laughs> what is it? Try to think right now. If I had the spring water, I would definitely do that little trick that was discovered recently, but I don't really 
have the, uh, I don't, I, I, like, I don't really have that. Nor do I really have use for it over here. Or, like, down here. Oh, gotta line myself up. Okay, I'm gonna do a little bit more. Okay, that's all I can really do. Gotta be careful. And now there are pea hats just wandering around. I'm gonna get this out just in case. Or actually this. Okay, wait for that to go down. These guys are probably gonna come after me now. Okay, just barely missed, but I'm gonna wait for it to go back up again so I can actually go and get them. Like, go, like, over there. Okay. Yeah, now they're gonna be attacking me. Oop. Ow. You have anything for me? Nope. Nothing that really useful, at least. And magic. Alright. I am willing to take that. And that too. Anything on this side for me? Yeah! Alright. Perfect. We are set and ready to go. And now a lot of those items are gone too. And thankfully we're playing the HD version of this game. Otherwise this part would be like almost impossible. Well not really, but like just very difficult. There we go. Okay, that was really easy. Holy cow. <laughs> Alright, Kalidemos is done. I forgot what the uh, the Poe guy was, though. I forgot what his name was. Probably something really easy to remember. I'll, I'll put it up on, on screen. All I know is that the other boss name is uh, uh, Mulgara. Oh, yeah. I like this. It's music here. Um. Probably gonna do that. Alright, so what I need to do right now is just roll, 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 ow, roll, roll, roll. Good on you if you know what that reference is. Okay, okay, now we got that guy to deal with. Okay, nope. You're not getting my lucky charms. You are not getting my lucky charms. Ow, oh, oh no, oh no, ow, 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 ow. Ah, oh, I did it. Ah, uh, yes! Okay, I, I guess I got through that without actually dealing with the uh, the proper... Like, doing it the proper way. So first I'm gonna go through here! Ow! Uh, anybody that bad? No, nope. it's actually not too difficult to get through here now. Ugh. Okay, so what we need to do now is just do some epic dodging skills right here. Epic dodging skills, what am I talking about? Eh. Bring this here. Uh Ah Okay. Ah Should not have done that. Okay, gotta deal with that guy way over there. Can I please do what I'm supposed to do? Okay. Oh jeez, come on, man. Oh, oh yes. That was lucky. That was really lucky. Okay. Now let's actually deal with this boss, for real. Don't know why that took me so long. No, I don't want to pick up that. Hold on. There we go, that's a good use of, of that. Learned it from Nintendo Capri Sun. Uh, jeez, oh no. No! Ah! Uh. Interestingly enough, I learned it from him. Oh, come on! No, no, I don't want that to happen. And I want to pick the him up now, please. Thank you. There we go. Now we only have like five left around that. Okay. Uh, we are good on as far as like other items go. So. Uh, uh, ah, come on. Oh, great. Uh, no. 
telling you, it's Let's Player's Curse. Oh, I guess if I get hit, then, uh, then I'm... <laughs> yeah, I guess I regain sanity or something. But why is this, like, much more, like, harder to, like, to do anything? Like, it doesn't seem like it should be. Maybe I'm just, like, losing my edge. There we go. All right. And now we have uh, Mulgara left. And then we actually get into the tower. Okay, let's go into here. And actually, face him. Okay. Oh, great. I hear him. I hear him way over there. Oh, up there. I hear him, like, very, uh, very distantly. And that was enough to kill him. Okay. Right? No, I hear another one. Okay. I think I have to get up there. I I'm not remembering correctly, I guess, but let's see. Or do I just have to go right in between those, uh, those gusts? Might be that. Yeah, okay. Ah, great. Okay. Got to... What do I have to do here? I'm I'm forgetting. I haven't played this in a, like a while. Like I haven't been here in a while, so I really don't remember. Like the only version of Ganon's Tower that I sort of have memorized. Oh, okay. There, that's that's our solution right there. I only have the uh, the Ocarina of Time version of Ganon's Tower in my head, and that's about it. Oh, I like this version of this this song. And it should be easier this time around because we actually have a little bit of a more powerful sword this time. But then again, it's probably also going to be very difficult because those guys again that are going to be flying around everywhere, they're here and they're going to try to distract me. Yeah, these guys. I hate them so much. They, they're like, hey, you should log on to me instead. It's like their only purpose. And I'm not going to attempt to do the glitch here again. Uh, okay. No. Thank you. Ah. <sighs> yeah, that, that's why I hate these guys so much. Oh, great. And now, also my battery's low. <laughs> Everything is going to poo right now. How can I kill these guys? Okay, I'm just gonna deal with these guys for a little bit. Actually, no. Up. Uh. It's not entirely necessary, but it would have been a good idea, because there's like a bunch of them now. Hold on. There we go, now I'm charging. So that should help a little bit with the uh, the video quality, I guess. Just like the professional amount of quality. Well, it's not even professional, but it's just like, it's nicer now. I, you don't see that blinking on screen anymore. And I, I didn't realize he was open. There we go. End of the boss rush. At least... That's what we think, right? Alright, and now it is wide open for us to go into. Sweet. Now I need stuff to- I need to refill everything. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, great, we have these little mini blends. Ow. They're always so annoying. And yeah, we are good. Let's actually enter his lair. And I really like the music in here, too. Okay, so there are four switches up here. I'm gonna actually equip my boomerang because that's how you actually hit them, but you have to hit them in a specific order. And I forgot what that order is, actually. So, I'm gonna go to the other side real quick because I'm not sure. 
Oh, here we go. I guess this is our solution. One... Two... Three... And four. Hey. Link, you must remember well the appearance of this room. The shape of the floor, the number of items hanging on the walls. Such things are the keys to solving the riddles that lie ahead. Do not overlook anything. What's this? The sword hilts of my servants who lurked deep in the darkness shall be the guideposts that point to me. Okay, you'll see what that means later. I actually needed that to be verified. Because I wasn't sure. But let's go and uh, actually hit them in that specific order. These switches here is what I mean. Is what I mean, rather. So yeah, like that. That one there, too. One on the, the right there. And the... Uh, First one on the, or the second one on the left. Now we have a dark portal. And out comes the King of Red Lions. <laughs> and Link is all freaked out. I see. So this is the portal through which Ganon was able to seep into the unsuspecting world above. So yeah, this is what Ganon used, I guess, to get up. Out, like out of uh, like out of Hyrule into the world. Link, we shall make use of this path that Ganon created for himself. If there's anything from the world above that you believe you need, then climb into the boat and enter the Column of Darkness. I don't need to use it right now, actually, because I'm all prepared. I have fairies and a uh, and some soup, so I'm pretty good. So let's continue, shall we? I'm just gonna pull out my arrows and put them in there, just in case. So now, what we must do is jump. And now here's a difficult part for me, especially now, because because uh, I have a delay. Ah, great. Okay. And now what we must do is actually follow these, uh, like the hilts of these swords that he drops. And yes, they are actually usable swords, but we can't use them right now. Because that is not really possible. It, like, because they're in different rooms, obviously. But now... Gotta fight him. Ah! Gotta play a little bit of tennis! Okay, I see how you do that. Ah. Okay, let's go over here. I believe there is a way to actually get through this part without having to like uh, worry about the order, like uh, like without having to wait for the swords. You can actually just walk through everything automatically, like without having to know like absolutely everything. And now he's like spamming this attack. Ah, ow. Okay. There we go. Boom. Uh, let's continue. Continue onward. Ow. I'm just gonna have to stick with doing that, I guess. Okay. That should be our way out, right? No. We still have one more, I think. There we go. Please be the way out. No. Here we go. Okay. And now, this way. And this is, I think, the last place. Yeah. Here we go. Ah. Okay, thankfully I have an extra fairy. Here we go. Ah, whoops. Boom. 
and that is the way out. But first, we have something for us to use. Wonder what it is. The light arrow. The sacred light of these arrows can pierce pure evil itself. And these arrows are so OP. It's like, it's crazy. But now we are out. But not without another fight. Ow. I don't like it when he uses that attack there. Makes me nervous. Really? I don't like it when he uses that one either. Ah, oh, man, that was the wrong thing to do. And at least he's using that attack now. Ah, oh, what? Ah, what? It's like I could have sworn I got him. How is he? <sighs> really? Why is he doing that? Oh, no, wait. I know why. I know why. It's because... I have a light arrow. Because he was actually pure evil. I'm gonna try to heal myself a little bit, real quick. Because I definitely need it. If I can find an extra fairy, I'll grab that. Now you may be wondering why I actually have his sword with me. Well, it's because of this. 